hello hello everyone it's me jessica and welcome back to my channel today we are going to dive into some 100 baby we're gonna have some birthdays if i'm not mistaken we're gonna kind of talk about the plans for the wedding and in the next part we will have the wedding because i'm hoping to get some kids out of the house and be a little bit closer to the end of this part of the story and i'm just excited to kind of finalize on my decision i haven't gotten any feedback from anyone like resisting the idea of phoebe being the um the next heir and um i do want to be upfront about the fact that if it did present itself as a problem for her at least having like another 20 kids in her age frame i probably would have her do like a potion of youth or something like that um with the aspiration points that we had worked for i would you know, not cheat the aspiration points, but I would cheat her age in that sense, um, which I know is kind of against the rules, but with the 100 baby challenge, I feel like being 100% with the rules is, I mean, it's too tedious, you know, who's got time for it? Um, but I hope in real life, you guys are doing great. I'm excited to get into this part, so let's do it. All right, guys, we are in Create a Sim, and we're gonna go ahead and give Kale this makeover that I have been promising. Um, so first and foremost, we do have him in his every way, every way, everyday outfit. Um, I made sure of that, um, but we need to give him better eyebrows, first things first. Ooh, not that bushy. I kinda don't hate that. I want them uh, maybe a bit thicker. You know, it's it's so tricky sometimes. Like those are a bit too primped and proper for me. For a dude eyebrows, you know, I don't really. Yeah, actually these. Nice and not too long, not too curved, not too, I mean, they look a little overgrown. Okay, I'm down with those. Um, I think I'm gonna leave his like beard the way it is. The current hair he has, I believe, is from Realm of Magic. Okay, it's under short, apparently. Um, no, it's from the Jungle Adventure Pack. Um, and I, I honestly, I, I very much like his hair. Um, it just looks a little Fabio-esque. So I don't know that I want to change him a whole lot. Um, Maybe we can give him some pants, or uh, actually, I guess jeans maybe, that are not quite so tight. Maybe some of these, like Ooh. dark ones. Yeah, we'll start there. And then maybe, um, where is jackets? No, up here. Jackets, there we go. I always forget that jackets is like so much towards the top. Okay, and then they live in kind of a cold place. I still want him to kind of have that like hipster vibe though. Uh -oh. Maybe this tiny living could be pretty hipster-esque. Yeah, I'm, I'm digging that. I'm digging that. All right, what's, um, Let's maybe make it a little less dark. I uh, used to make all of their um, formal wears like in case of a funeral, kind of. I don't know if I like the white. Um, I didn't really want to spend a whole lot of time on this. Anyways, though, I used to make my formal wares so much so with uh, funerals in mind that, like, that was maybe the only time you would really use the formal wear. Um, let's just give him a red suit that looks slick. Okay, I think I'm fine with that. Um, yeah, you know what? That's fine. Um... I think that that's a styled look and I didn't really care whenever I made him because I didn't play with him a whole bunch uh, originally. Let's give him these like 
because like I said, I want him to have that like hipster edge to him. You know, honestly, that was like a nice change. I'm digging that with the shoes and everything. Okay, so this is his swimwear. That's kind of boring. Um, I don't know, let's give him like, let's give him these purple ones. Yeah, sure, why not? Why not, you know? Um, that's kind of how I feel. Ooh, eco lifestyle ones, green. I always go for green shorts. Um, it's kind of my husband's fault. He, he loves green and so it's almost like he's conditioned me to make all the, the stuff green. Um, ooh, let's give him this shirt. Nothing is more hipster than this shirt right here. No, not with those shorts. Honestly, that is not a good mix. I am not digging that at all. Um, maybe just like this Island Living shirt like in black. Yeah, that's probably fine. Um, but the glasses have got to go oh, and the earrings. Oh, buddy. <clears throat> okay, last one here. We're looking at his cold wear. Um, I don't hate that top, but I'm not the biggest fan of red. It's just such a like ugh, color to me, um, you know, associated with like rage. Um, I, I don't know. It's just not my favorite. Let's give him this nifty knitting one because I feel like that kind of screams just like getting um, a little bit older and comfortable with my sexuality and my manhood and the fact that I'm just an old man and like, you know, I'm just hanging out at home being, being lazy. I don't have anything going on in my life because I'm just an old man about to get married. She's got 20 babies. Like we're never going to do it. A Oh, I actually like those boots. Those are some of my favorites. Um, but yeah, he's like, I, I'm not going to have another kid. One of her kids is my kid, but okay. So that is his everyday. I hope you guys like his little makeover. Um, I don't think we really need to look at anyone else. I'm pretty sure I, we already like looked at Rocky whenever we did the girls makeover. And he's a, about to move out of the house. The girls are about to age up. Like everyone is about to kind of shift. So let's get into it. <laughs> All right, guys, we are in the house and I am straight up just pulling the save file up with you guys. I haven't checked on them at all. Um, so let's kind of double check on everyone's kind of status. Give it a second to get with the program here. Eddie, sorry to bother you, but I've heard you're a great person. Um, I, yeah, I don't know. Th well, thanks. I'm happy that you've heard such a thing. Um, can we upgrade this? Yeah, let's have her upgrade that. That might be something that I let BB take with her. Um, cause she's pretty much gonna start back from like a starter home. Um, not like from the ground up, but <laughs> did you see her? Like the ball went over there, um, theoretically speaking, I guess. Okay, anyways, let's check back in. We've got Rocky here. Um, Cause it is Sunday at like 5 p.m. Okay. Um, it looks like he's got a skill in his homework where they should be for right now. Um, I don't know if we realistically need him to come down here and do this or not, but let's have him do it just in case. And then Sarah, just, I'm, I'm sure I did this on my way out the door last time, but just want to double check where everyone is at, what's going on. Okay, Skylar is up here go into the restroom. Um, we should probably have her get a bite to eat, it looks like. Oh, she's a C student, but her homework and everything is where it should be. I thought Sarah is a B student. Oh, no, they're both C students. Okay. Now, for the, the real question is, can we age this squirt up yet or not? Um, and actually, mm, gotta do something. 
I am a big old silly bum and I realized that last time um, whenever I was recording I have the, the stereo that was on the wall right here above the dollhouse because um, in theory that is a cute idea but <laughs> you know I have <laughs> been reminded recently that they cannot sleep when there's a radio on in the room and doy but you know here I am this far in in this house with this one under baby challenge and I have had that stereo there the whole time you know okay let's get back into it um but at least kiddo will be able to get some good sleep now that sim god jessica has gotten her stuff and put it all together in a bag and she's just gonna ship it off in a basket in the ocean for everyone so you don't have to deal with that okay anyways what's kale doing he's taking a nap not the best duder you should just sleep um, we probably could have Phoebe come out here. Uh, these, ooh, these need to be sold. Okay, yeah, have her sell all of that stuff. Um, we're gonna let him finish that. And then he can come up here and, uh, go to sleep. You know, I didn't even check on Tate's skills, so let's do that. Um, four, two, 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 two. Oh my gosh. Okay, so imagination and thinking are pretty much the worst. Um, we're definitely gonna let him sleep for right now. And then, imagination. Oh, he's waking up. Okay, well, you know what? Just play with some dolls and you can go back to sleep because I didn't want you to wake up. I wanted it to just like be in your queue, buddy fine we'll just let him do it um honestly she yeah because realistically i didn't do any gameplay off screen so they like just got engaged kale is actually almost kind of caught up on his sleep but we will uh let him do a bit more sleeping so she doesn't like get in bed and he just gets out of bed like that's kind of awkward like oh <laughs> Sorry, honey, I just, um, I don't want to be in bed at the same time as you. Like the, mmm. Just women overthinking things. You know how people do that sometimes? Like how I think that the bed is broken instead of the stereo being the problem. It's just laughable, you know? Okay, well, I'm hoping that we can definitely finish out this part with removing Rocky from our family and having another makeover sesh with the girls. I'm so excited for them. No, they're not going to age up in this part. Um, let's just be realistic about that. I would have to do a little off-camera play right now, which may be feasible. My daughter um, has just waited all day to take her nap. Nick like all day. She is so tired. <laughs> so she is asleep right now. And uh, it's it's glorious. She was awake for hours this morning. Um, what do we have in our food reservoir? Because we only have one toddler. Yeah, let's just have her come grab some tofu tacos. And then he can grab... Um, whatever that is. What is, what is that? These are Rice Krispie treats, aren't they? Oh my gosh, they are. You know what? Go for it, bud. Who ever said that you can't have Rice Krispie treats, you know? Just, you do you. Wait, where's Phoebe? Oh, I had her outside doing the gardening. Okay. Well, that's fine. Okay, at least she, I was like, has she ever introduced herself to Kale? This is your like stepfather um, that you probably do not care about because the, your mom has so many baby daddies. It's how do you keep up? 
but that is not the point. We love Naomi. You'd be nice to your mom. She works hard, all right? She works really hard to provide for you chillins. Okay, Tate is hungry, which is no surprise. Yeah, let's make sure he gets some tofu taco. I guess that's appropriate for a toddler. <laughs> um, my daughter would not want a tofu taco, but she is um, barely a toddler. You know, she is 14-ish um, months old, you know, like 1.2 years for those people out there who hate that, that lingo of months talk. It's just whenever you're like, you know, a little worm and you can't walk or anything when you're born, every month you really grow a lot. <laughs> Anyways, we're not talking about my daughter, it's fine. Um, this shower is really dirty, that's disgusting. You should probably clean that, Kale. You should probably do your part and clean that, even though we have a maid for that. That's not the point. Um, I'm gonna wake up uh, Rocky so that he can actually come down and get some food. Where do I have the girls at with their stuff? She's up here playing doctor, is that right? Yes, okay. Which this like works on mental and empathy and I really like that it's like a dual purpose toy like that. While we have Tate awake right now, He's done eating. We're gonna have him come over and play with some dolls and then he can go back to sleep. Um, he, poor little guy, is just forever tired. It's just toddler life is rough, you know? But I am determined we will get him aged up in this part. I will be done with toddlers for right now in this part. <laughs> just for right now though. Okay, and Sarah, she will need to go back to bed. Just such a busy household. It's so hard to keep up sometimes. Like everything going on. Um, like, see, she, it's literally, it is midnight and she needs to wake up and take a shower. I just, I can't keep up with these kids sometimes. Ooh, level up that skill though. Is it really about to level up? Oh no, it's not. It's only 60%. I hate that whenever it, um, it I don't know if that happens to anyone else, um, but I get like fake bars like that and I don't really understand why it does that to me. I don't know if he was simultaneously working on a different skill, I, I don't know. Seems very fishy to me. All right, guys, there's gonna be a little cut here because real life, my daughter woke up. I think I jinxed it. Um, need to mute my TV back. Okay. <clears throat> okay, um, but in that time, I actually did do a little bit of that off camera play that I said that I couldn't do because I just wanted to play with you guys. Um, but since she woke up, I did just a little bit. <clears throat> We got his imagination just over three, and his thinking is just about ready to tip that scale and uh, be level three. But right now he needs to sleep, so we're letting him do that. Naomi is over here doing her thing. Um, I did have her finish a book in that time, but it was only an excellent book. We need one more bestseller, and I think she'll be like good on her um, aspiration, uh, like actually will have finished it. Um, Phoebe is hanging out and talking to he's feeling embarrassed. I don't like I don't know if she's trying to flirt with him. Yeah, I don't know. Honey, you can't flirt with him. He's the father of one of your siblings. I think Hobart, maybe. Um, it's not going to happen. We, we can't do that. He's feeling really embarrassed. Uh, he walked in on something that he didn't want to see. Okay. 
Okay, so maybe it's not something that she said. Maybe she's not trying to flirt with him. <clears throat> I don't know. Hopefully not. Naomi. Beautiful Naomi. We love you. We do. But it's time to get rid of you. It's time. It is. It is so time for you to be out of our lives. Oh, hi. I, this must be awkward for you. We're sorry. Honestly, like, it's nothing personal. We've done this to so many men. My apologies. Oh, is she gonna come in and, like, flirt with her man right in front of her daughter? Nothing more awkward than that. <laughs> Okay, he reached logic level two, which is exciting for him. Let's get him out of there. He seems to be feeling, I don't know, maybe stressed or something from this situation. Um, who's calling him? Winner, winner. Uh, Rocky won a school. Oh, he doesn't have, like, good parenting advice, though, so. Okay, well, that's fine. Um, Rocky has entered what? Uh, was that like a phase? Oh, no, he received an excellence funny. Good for you, bud. Um, so something I was kind of thinking is we, there's a bunch of medicine on her desk as well. Uh, people keep coming to get on her computer. There's a glass. Is that not a glass? Oh, it's not. Okay. I thought that there was a glass, like, <clears throat> in the computer. Okay, write a playful book. Maybe because you're feeling playful, and it will, I don't know, do something for your chances of writing a bestseller. Because that's what we need for you, is just to write a bestseller. <laughs> um, I, I don't exactly know what I want for her to do for her money. I was kind of considering juicing as an option. Um, because of where, and I'm not going to give away any spoilers just yet. Um, because it, I guess it could always change. Um, because we're still a few parts away from that. But, um, depending on if we're living where I think we'll live, we would have a pretty good chance at like having juicing products on hand. Just my thoughts for the day. Okay, let's wake him up. Um, let's let him come get a bite to eat. Okay, I really wish that it would just bring the uh, phone calls up. It's just Johnny Landgrab, but oh. Well, I was gonna say yes, but can't do that now. Um, just one serving. That's, that's all I want from you is just grab one serving. Phoebe is still over here. I don't even know what she's doing. Is she like chatting? Oh, she is. Hmm. Um, I, I do want to get her out or maybe even just at the wedding in the next part, I want for her to socialize and kind of get some people that she knows. Um, Cause I think right now she definitely doesn't have like any relationships on hand. She's been feeling a little bit lonely at times. Um, and I, you know, she's a young adult living at home right now. So she's definitely probably feeling a bit lost, but what do you do, you know? Um, hopefully this is a bestseller because, you know, what we're looking at for her right now is that she just needs one more bestseller and then she is done with this aspiration. Um, <laughs> so please just write a bestseller. I guess we can just let Phoebe come up here and, uh, kind of work on her wellness skill. Practice some yoga, my dear. kind of bouncing around real quick. Um, are you done eating? Is that, come and work on this? 
become shapes for me, dear. Skylar has returned home with a project. Okay. Oh, that's Phoebe. I meant Rocky. Rocky, are you an A student? Yes, yes. Is his somology, does he have his responsibility in range? Of course he does. Okay, beautiful. Do we have a cake? Oh, he just came over and took a medicine. All on his own, okay. Um, we do have a cake in the inventory, okay. All right, we're gonna have him come over. Blow out candles. Come on, Rocky. This is your time to shine, buddy. <laughs> We're so, so proud of you. You worked so hard. <laughs> do it, do it, do it. Yes, happy birthday to you, Rocky. Get out of the house. <laughs> I will never sing for you guys again, I promise. Um, Angelus, okay, romantic, Angelus, geeky, animal lover. Honestly, like he's kind of a catch. The jealous trait, kind of weird, um, but you, you can still manage with that. Um, add some birthday candles to that little buddy, and then we'll let him get, um, no, actually, I'm just gonna tell Naomi to stop writing her playful book and what in her inventory, I believe. We have the nice camera. Let's get some pictures taken with him. And I, I swear if I don't make sure it's the medium sized photo this time, I will cry. Um, and we'll let, that happen real quick before we have Phoebe come over and help Tate with the candles. Because <clears throat> I believe he is now level, yes, level three. Okay, here we go. Picture time, picture time. Oh, okay, medium sized. Look at me go. I don't know if we need the flash. We'll do a couple with and a couple without. He's a good looking kiddo. I'm gonna have Tate come over and ask Naomi to help out with the uh, <clears throat> the cake real quick. We'll let Rocky hang out for right now. Um, let him get a shower, kind of rest up and stuff before we kick him out of the house. Oh, nope. Nope. You're not going to sleep. You're not. <laughs> Ask for candle help. Please do it, do it, do it. <laughs> I very much just want to get this uh, little little tater here, this little tater bean, tater tot. Um, can can we please just wake up? Okay, I don't want him to sleep. Catherine Fang. Um, yeah. Uh huh. She, uh, she heard that we came, became friends with her brother and that we did. Okay. We are aging up the last toddler of, um, the Naomi rain of the woods rain. The next ones may be Holly's. Who knows? Stella. Some people love art, but everyone loves a popular artist. You're the talk of the town. No, nope. thank you. All right, Tate, what are you? Good. Okay. Well, no, 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 no. A rambunctious scamp, huh? Okay. I feel like we get that one a lot, but that's okay. Um, add birthday candles. Add birthday candles. Um, I doubt that the girls—they're not ready, are they? 
Yeah, no, C student, okay, that's fine. Um, let's put the cake back. At least we got some kids aged up. Um, Tate, my dude. So what we'll probably do is we'll give Tate a makeover whenever the girls age up in the next part. So for right now, I'm not going to, to give him a makeover. Just, just not gonna do it, you can't make me. <laughs> okay, Tate, buddy, you got a bed. You're a big kid, you can bathe yourself. I'm so happy we're done with that part of your life. It's great, it's a great feeling. Actually, are you also a C student? Is that where we're at with our life? A B student, okay, good job, good job, look at you out here just conquering the world. <laughs> um, I cannot wait. We're going to sell all of this like toddler stuff. We're done with it. We are done with it. Um, but let's have her come up here and go to sleep. Um, this is maybe about all we're going to do in this part. I'm kind of trying to think if there's anything else that I was really looking for. And I honestly, like, I've been trying to kind of keep the parts a little bit shorter. Um, because for me, with the, the moving 14-month-old bean that is just out of control and whatnot, it's a little bit easier for me to edit a video that's about, like, 30 minutes long. So it, it obviously takes me more than 30 minutes to edit it. Um, Owen, I, or Owen... Rocky, I don't know why you're down there. You should really take the time that you have right now to to sleep. Because we are <clears throat> probably just in the next part, I guess. We're going to kick him out of the house. Um, I don't know. I guess we can let him hang out for maybe another part. Because we'll have the party of um, the wedding. You know, the, the wedding party um, in the next part. And I guess it would be nice to just like kind of have him to maybe help out. I, I don't know. We don't really need him. It's not like we can't invite him. But everyone's sleeping. It's so quiet. Um, maybe we can actually have her finish her book really quick. Um, let's see if we can get her to finish. Uh, what was that? Like the great pixie something? What did I just see that? Oh, I don't know. It's okay. Well, everyone's just kind of vibing. It's uh, really nice and just peaceful lately in this house. Um, is that a plate? No, it's just the box, I guess. Um, Kale has been kind of just a, a seamless addition to the house. He's not like doing a whole lot to help out and that's okay. Because I didn't want to be like cheating in the series. That's why I I waited until we were done having babies and we were taking care of the toddler ourselves. We didn't have him bathe the toddler or anything like that. Um, so we're, we're doing our part to make sure Kale is just doing this. <laughs> just eating our food and wearing his jammies. I mean, I guess it's 8.15 at night, so it's not really like out of his element to be in his jammies right now. Ooh, come and clean this. Clean with vigor. Yes, get it. <laughs> um, what's going on up here? Yeah, let's see if we can get her to finish this book really quick. And if she does, oh, she's thinking about Ivy. I'm honestly, I really liked Ivy. Um, I think that I, I don't know if it's just because she's a goth and the goths are my favorite um, townie family. It could be that. Um, but I just, I liked the, something about her. She just was like very chill. Okay. She's finishing up the book. Is it a bestseller? Is it a bestseller? It, it'll say like congratulations or something like that. I believe. Is that an achievement? Um, okay. I don't know. Let's, let's go down here. <clears throat> let's see. Let's see. Zelda publisher. Is it a bestseller? Oh, it's just excellent. Oh, that's so frustrating. Um, yeah, I don't know what we're going to do to uh, get her to stink and write another bestseller, but we're going to make it happen at some point, one way or another. Um, but okay, 
Well guys, I'm gonna go ahead and cut it here. I think in the next part, we are absolutely having the wedding party um, and hopefully aging up the teenage or the girls into teenagers. Fingers crossed that that's in the next part. Um, we'll have to make sure that they maybe get another project done or something right out of the gate. So um, yeah, thanks for stopping by. Stay safe out there and I'll catch y'all later. Bye.